can you live with just a granny charger? That has been my experiment for the last month. Our story is we are about to move house. So we've got this new MG5 and we are going to move house in the next couple of months. And so there's no point putting in a proper charging system into the house. So we've just been living off the granny charger, plugged into our kitchen through the window. And has it been possible to just live like this? And the answer to that is yes. This is the amount of miles we've done and it has been possible, but it has been a bit of a pain. The main issue you have is that you're basically charging all of the time because it charges so slowly over uh, the grain charger you have to basically whenever you go on a decent journey you have to actually just plug it in as soon as you get back and that's fine but it's just been a bit of a faff taking it in the kitchen window out the kitchen window in the kitchen window out the kitchen window and for any longer journeys you're really having to think ahead so you have to plan ahead and think what's coming up this week do i need to get some charge in the in the car because because it will take that long. I think it's 30 hours to fully charge from zero, but even obviously doing half of that is still a serious amount of time. Here is my testing for the last two weeks of this month. So I've gone two weeks, I've recorded the charging that we did, and you'll see here, it's, it's pretty much every other day. There's a few days where, the start here, it's a couple of days in a row, if you've gone on a couple of decent-ish journeys, the lowest it ever got to at this point was, uh, was here, when I think it was down at maybe 45%. So the car hasn't been really pushed to its limit range-wise, but we're still doing some significant charging most days. And these last couple of days, I knew I was going to do a go to a Tesla supercharger, so I didn't need to, but it, would, it got down to about 50% by this day here. There is a load of stuff on the internet around the safety of them being plugged into just random pl plugs in the house. Uh, our house is relatively new, so it's not been uh, an issue on that side. It doesn't The charger doesn't get hot, uh, just gets slightly warm. But yeah, the main issue really is just, you're just plugging it in all the time. And I, I think if it was like an emergency, suddenly you needed to make a long journey and you, you had like 30% battery, you'd be a bit stuck. You'd have to go off and find a fast charger somewhere. So um, it's definitely doable. You can live with just a granny charger, but it's inconvenient. But there you go. That's enough of this one. See you soon. Bye.